What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm in the coop for show. Candy coat, candy woo. Make sure my gel on my coat. I'm on fro. Alright, let's get right into it. This Christmas I mainly got house appliances and utensils and such because I am planning on moving out within the year. And this saves me a lot of money and I really appreciate everyone who gave me these gifts. Shout out to you guys. Thank you so much. It saved me a ton of money and I mean it's all like good stuff. Like I I like the colors of it. I I no, I need it, and some of them are actually somewhat expensive. So, like, anything will help, and I really appreciate that. So, I'll start out here at the bottom. I got a, like, a forks, knives, tray for, like, the drawer. I thought that was pretty neat, because I don't want to put my utensils just straight on the drawer, so I won't do that now. And I got a bath mat. It's pretty basic. It's just this, but I really like it. I'm really into the neutral colors, like white, gray, black. And then I do want like an accent color in my apartment, which will be most likely teal or this color, which I, I really do like this color. It goes good with the gray as well. And I really like these colors together. So that's probably what I'll end up doing. So here's just a washcloth and then here's a towel. I had a few of these. I'm not going to show you everything because there's a lot of small stuff that I can't really get in the video as much. On to this. This was in my stock. Two pound bag of double size Sour Patch Kids. I love Sour Patch Kids. I don't eat them that much anymore though. These are really good. I feel like the double size ones are better for some reason. They're not really, but I just like them better. And got Ghirardelli Peppermint Bark, which is really good. I never really had it until recently, so glad I got this now. Next, we have a cookie sheet. Who doesn't cook cookies every now and then? So like, this will come in handy when I instead of having to be like, oh, I want cookies. And I try to look for a cookie tray and I don't have one. Now I have one. So that's very, very helpful. And then here I have like bathroom soap dispensers. Uh, let's see. Toothbrush holder, toothpaste, stuff like that. And then like a soap holder for the shower. I really like that. Not even the shower. I can just use this um, next to my sink. I like that. Here's the trash can. I'm pretty sure I picked this one out couple months ago but no i like this a lot it comes with a small one too that i could put in like the living room no not the living room i'll probably put the small one in my bathroom and then this one go in my kitchen and as you can see i'm really going for the gray theme which i mean that's just pretty basic but i feel like there's a lot more potential when you do gray because then you can like mix red you know purple green teal some of those colors are kind of ugly but you know i mean it, it gives you more like leeway when you're trying to like pick a couch you're like oh i like this couch but would that go in my house but it would because everything goes with your house i really love this i i use trash cans a lot my trash can in my room is always full so that's great it's a five gallon no eight gallon trash can and a 1.3 gallon trash can so that's great over here i got a hammer it was the first thing i pulled out of my stocking and then i i was really confused i was like yay a hammer I like, I didn't know what to do. I didn't want to like look unimpressed, but I was pretty unimpressed when I pulled out a hammer because I didn't know how to react because I was confused. But no, I really appreciate it because I know I'll use a hammer, especially moving into the house. This will be very helpful. Building shelves and such, anything that I need, I can I now have a hammer for it. And this is a nice heavy duty hammer. And as well as that, I got a three piece tool set with screwdrivers, uh, pliers, vice grip, drill bits. I got lots of drill bits. That'll come in handy as well when just around the house in general. Maybe not like all the time, but definitely will help. And this, I'm sure this was like 20 bucks. So that saves me 20 bucks. See is that? Like all this stuff is going to be used. So I'm really thankful. And here we go over here. I got a, a frying pan. And then it came with swivel peeler. I thought that was really funny because like I've only seen these maybe like four times in my life. But, no, I appreciate it because it'll be good. Maybe. I don't know. See myself cooking like that. Like with cucumbers or carrots, whatever. I don't even know what else you'd use. That's not supposed to be there. Trash can. I missed. Anyway. So, I got um tablespoons. That'll come in handy for cooking, for sure. I know I'd use those because that would not be on my list when I'm moving out. I wouldn't be like, oh, I forgot the tablespoons. But now I have them so good because... Those just seem pretty unnecessary for me, and I wouldn't want to waste my own money on it. But shout out to the people that did waste their own money on it, aka my parents. Appreciate it. And then just another one, the bigger ones. 
I guess these are quarter cups to a cup. Then next I got salt shakers, salt and pepper shakers, I guess. These are from Ikea. I love Ikea. I've never been, but I definitely have seen it around and I've seen like videos in there and stuff. Really cool for store. I'd love to go there, but there's the closest one is in Charlotte. But my mom went to New York like a few weeks ago. I actually have a video on that, but it won't let me like download it onto iMovie. So I'm gonna try and do it when I get my new computer. Definitely appreciate this because all my life I've just felt like these are in, like they never run out of salt and pepper. Have you ever thought about that? Like you never see someone fill up the salt and pepper shaker, but it's always full. No joke. Yeah, so I guess, I mean, I'm not in the kitchen that much. You know, just the frying pan. It's a nice one too. It's not like cheap. And it's, you know, black. I feel like there's some ugly frying pans, but this is good. It feels really weird on the bottom. I don't know. It's like a bunch of like circles or lines in a circle. Yeah, it feels weird. Uh, and here's hairspray. I really appreciate this because I go through maybe one of these a month, maybe less than a month. This is what I use for um, my hair to be like this. Just that was harder than it should be. And then just I don't want to use too much because it's very powerful when it first opens up. But yeah, no, this is how I get my hair to be how it is. This is literally like my only thing I need to do to get ready. This and deodorant and it's pretty much it for my like <laughs> get ready with me's or whatever. So I'm probably not going to do any of those because it's pretty simple other than like putting my outfit. That's like putting on my outfit and picking it out is like the hardest part of getting ready for me. And that's it pretty easy for me i got four of these but i put one away already so there's three here but you you get it you don't need to see all four all right and then we'll go up here to my knife set i was really confused when i was opening this because it was really heavy and it's pretty big so like i was like i wonder what this could be you know i didn't know but it turned out it was a knife set and that's great i picked this one out too i think maybe thanksgiving we went to walmart for black friday and we just i looked around showed my mom some things and this was one of them it has a sharpener on it as well. It comes with scissors and like all sizes of knives, steak knives, regular knives, all that stuff. So this is great. Cause again, this is probably, I mean, this feels and looks like it's really good quality. I think KitchenAid is one of the most used kitchen appliance brands. Feel it, probably like $30, $40. I don't even know how much knife sets cost, but this is a really good, good one, I think. I'm excited to set it out and decorate my apartment. That'll definitely be, be a video for sure. That's gonna be great. And I'm pretty sure if I do it, as he's going to record it too, because we both enjoy like redecorating, decorating houses, rooms, whatever. It's really fun being able to be creative and coming up with your own little vibe in the house. Really like that. And then we got spoons over here. I, it's like a spatula, one of those like bent spoons that are like a bowl. It's a six piece nylon tool set with crock. I guess the crock is the little thing that it comes with. So that'll be helpful for like making eggs or macaroni and cheese because i'll be making a lot of those because that's easy <laughs> to be great i appreciate it definitely will put to use i like the boxing too i like this pretty cool it looks like one of those um uh, like things you put on the wall like decorations and lastly it's just one of these little stocking things i think grandparents gave me this isn't all they gave but this is it it's just like a little mini speaker it's actually not bad i mean it's not you know there's definitely better speakers but it's small and light and really simple and easy con to connect. It just has an on button and it has a skip and rewind or, you know, skip track, previous track button. And it's it's not bad at all. I'd probably use this in the shower just, you know, because I feel like my nicer speaker shouldn't be in the shower or not in the shower, but in the bathroom. Actually, my JB, I have a JBL Flip 4. I've had it for about a year and a half, two years. And it's like today, the day after Christmas, I'm pretty sure it's just like broken like it works but it's very like bad i think the speaker blew i don't know why because like it was fine yesterday and then today i just turned it on and it's not working but yeah so i'll definitely use this in like the shower and such shout out to you gramps and graham thank you so much all right guys so that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed and if you've gotten this far already don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and let me know what you think down in the comments below and i'll see you guys next time thanks so much